Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Woo! Oh wow! Woo! Yeah! I was contacted by Odie, who goes to a high school in in Iceland, and he asked me if. Um, I'd be willing to come out to Iceland to, to come and visit the school. What does this mean? And when I got the message, it was kind of unbelievable. I kind of didn't believe it at first, but, you know, of course I said, of course I'll come. You know, it was hard taking it seriously. I thought it might have been a joke. It sounded like a Cheech and Chong movie. <laughs> I film everything too. <laughs> So nice to see you. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for having me. Yeah, this is my first time off of North America, and uh, I had to get a passport specifically for this trip. <laughs> when I got here, you know, I was uh, I was greeted with with so much warmth and um, and shown you know s uh, amazing amount of love by by young people and by people in general, and had their homes opened up to me and just treated like. I'm like an honored guest, and it's really humbling and, and hard to understand. The double rainbow means a lot of things. Um, at the time that I was shooting it, I was um, convinced that it was God's eye that was looking at me. It was a complete disc of color. It wasn't, it wasn't just a rainbow anymore, it was a whole circle. I think that the rainbow came to me to have me deliver a message to humanity. And I've kind of s summed it up in uh, three simple things. The first is uh, love your fellow man because I think the Creator wants that more than anything. And the second is to walk more gently on Mother Earth. People need to try and live in a more sustainably, more ecological, less greedy way. And the last one is uh, connect to spirit. If um, you can appreciate nature, if you can connect to the spirit of the universe, to God, whatever you call it, then um, I think that's what uh, the part of what my mes mission and my message is about. I think that uh, the, the happiness that's within, within me comes from being connected to spirit and never losing the childlike attitude that, uh, that I have. Also, um, last year about this time I was in a very deep depression and I, I didn't want to live. but. Um, I held on because of my duty as a father. I think that um, knowing how low someone can go makes you appreciate like the highs that you have now. Life is good. It's so incredible the things that are happening to me. You know, people are flying me all over the world, and and money's coming in, and it's like everything that I can imagine and more is coming to me and it's it's kind of hard to understand I had to realize that it's it's not about me it's about the this work that I'm doing for for spirit for the universe for the creator for humanity With the wild horses Thank you.